What's up, everybody? This is Donald Stuckey. Thanks for joining me again. Today, I wanted to talk a little bit about checking your shutter actuation numbers and what your shutter actuation numbers is the amount of times that you've actually hit the shutter button on your camera. This is a picture of a shutter device that you find in most cameras, and it is made up of a number of different mechanical parts. And with any mechanical parts, they are they get regular wear and tear on them and regular wear and tear can cause regular can cause malfunctions when you actually go to use your camera in the field and so and this is with any mechanical device is that they just wear out over time so checking to see how many times this shutter device has actually been used becomes critically important for anyone who is a photographer, whether you're a professional or a photo hobbyist or anywhere in between. Now for Nikon and Canon users, this is very this is very simple. There are many tools that are available for Canon and Nikon users to check their shutter actuation numbers. But I did find a tool for Sony users. So at this website, tools.science.si, this is the online tool that you can use to check your um, shutter actuation numbers. So um, there's not an official name for it, but it still does work. And I will leave a link in the description of this video. So all you do is go to choose file. You pick the file that you're gonna um, that you're gonna use. All you need is a JPEG file. You can use RAW, but all you need is a JPEG file. You don't need it. It doesn't need to be edited, so you don't need to put it through Photoshop or Lightroom. So you just pick a regular JPEG file, open it up, hit do it, and in a few minutes, it is going to bring up uh, how many times the shutter has been hit for this particular file. So we can see that there have been 16,295 shutter actuations um, up to this current file um, on my Sony A99. And so that so the A99 is rated for about 150,000 shutter actuations. So that means that this file, that this camera is still in good shape, or at least the shutter is still in good shape and can still be used for some time. So I'm going to check one more of my cameras and that is my A7. And this tool is available for for both E-mount and A-mount cameras except for a few of them including the A700 uh, and a few others. That information is on this website. So we're just going to open it up. We're going to hit do it. And like before, it will give us the number for how many times the shutter has actually been used. So here we are, 1,000 shutter actuations up to this file um, for the A7. So this becomes a very useful tool, especially when you are purchasing a used especially when you're purchasing a uh, used camera. Um, it's just a good idea to ask that person who you're purchasing it from to send you over a, a recent JPEG file and just run it through this program and you will get how many times that the shutter has been hit up to that current, up to that file that you've been sent. So I hope this is helpful to someone. Thank you and I will see you in the next one.